I mean, the obvious way in which higher education connects with K-12 is the production of teachers, right, through, through traditional sort of higher education routes. Um, there, most institutions, including my own at the University of California, care a lot about the quality of the students and the preparation of the students as they come through the system. And especially for those students that have been historically underserved, the university, and it's true for the CSU as well, university systems are really eager, I think, to work in partnership with various K-12 institutions, whether they're county offices of education or their own local school districts, to try and develop programming that will prepare kids for life after high school. And, you know, ideally for many of us it's college, but for others it'll be the world of work. One way that we've found in the area that I'm in, it's in the Sacramento region, is these regional alliances which bring to the table the, the higher ed folks, the, the K-12 folks, business and industry, um, other nonprofits, funders where they're available, and so that we're talking about a common set of problems and ideally as we go forward a common set of, of goals and some metrics that as a region we can, we can promote and live with. And so I think that um, it's um, because each of the institutions have separate missions, you have to work hard at finding those bridges. And, but you've got to start by having the leaders of those institutions at the table. And so that's what the CSL net in, in, in fostering these regional alliances around STEM, it's not all of the K-12, but it's a starting point. And that's working really well for us. In my region too, it's easier because it's, although it's large, it's small enough so that all the leaders have a history of, of knowing one another. So when I got there as, as, as dean, I was from Los Angeles, I was surprised to find that people would actually call me back within 24 hours of, of my call as opposed to never or maybe a week or two later. So that's an advantage that we have, but that's really important. So I feel that I can, I can talk to anyone in any of these sectors about an issue of, uh, of common interest.